playing out. Mobile City leaders celebrating the official return of cruising to the port city. Carnival Spirit docking at the Alabama Cruise Terminal early this morning, loading up its first passengers out of Mobile before departing around 5 o'clock this afternoon. You saw it live right here on Fox 10. Fox 10 News Lee Peck on the story for us tonight. And Lee, a welcome return after Carnival had left a year ago. Well, that's right, Byron. I've been following this story for quite some time. I was here when the cruise ship returned in 2016, as well as when the pandemic shut it down and the ecstasy returning and then exiting Mobile a year ago. Mobile now once again trying to prove itself to Carnival and judging by today, it looks like we're off to a good start. Arriving early, Carnival Spirit making herself right at home at the Alabama Cruise Terminal. Larger than life, it's something the port city hasn't seen in a year. It was a true mobile welcome. The Excelsior Band doing their thing as passengers boarded the ship on her inaugural voyage. Stepping aboard just as exciting. The first passengers all the way from Lafayette, Indiana, Rick and Helen Moschinger got the honor of cutting the ribbon. Actually, it was kind of crazy. We weren't expecting it, but it was a lot of fun. Did you sign up or did you win something to be the first? Nope, just somebody came up to us. How would you like to be the first? Okay. It was almost overwhelming to have everybody there, the captain there, and just everybody and everybody applauding. It's, it makes you pretty emotional. Welcome aboard a beautiful carnival spirit, everybody. Fox 10 Shelby Myers taking a tour of the ship earlier today, which boasts more than 630 balcony rooms, a water park, and way more amenities than a ship out of Mobile has ever had. You can't be excited about this. I don't know what, you, what it's going to take to get you excited. Carnival equally excited about the opportunities in returning to the Mobile market. Carnival is so excited to be in Mobile, Alabama. This is one of the crew's favorite ports. They love to work out of uh, Mobile because the guests are so amazingly awesome. And while we didn't get the secret to how they fold those towel animals, we did get a photo op with this guy. And just like that, the spirit pulls away for the first of many times. Now setting sail for the Bahamas, she'll return to her new home in eight days. Of course, as we've reported, we'll be sharing this ship with Alaska for six months out of the year. Meanwhile, Mayor Simpson says work continues, investments being made to upgrade the terminal to attract not only a bigger cruise ship, but one that will be here year round. Live in studio tonight, Lee Peck, Fox 10 News.